Hi, Jonathan here, and we're fitting the shad top box and bracket system to the AK550, my long-termer for motorcycle sport and leisure. Now, as you can see from me fitting it in the background here, the shad system is a very easy one to go on. Simply remove the side grab handles from the AK. Now, that's two Allen key bolts on either side, and then they're replaced with Allen key bolts from shad that come with the kit, with the bracket itself. Now there's some collars that you have to put in to make sure that the bolts don't slip around and that the actual framework is nice and secure, but they're dead easy to slot into place. It's all been made absolutely fine to go on. Now, it's not a really big job. I haven't seriously looked into the instructions. It's pretty self-explanatory. And as you can see, it goes on really nicely and not too tricky at all. There's no cutting, there's no templates to follow in that respect. It's just offer it up, make sure it's in the right position and drop the bolts in. Now, with the top box itself, you do need to have a look at actually removing the underplate before you do anything else. Now the underplate has a covering plate on it and within there, there are numerous different holes available to fit many different brackets that Shad manufacture. Now, what you've got to do is there's some small red blocks which are liners for the holes so that should you need to use one of the expander or the stretch holes that are in there, you've got something for the bolt to grip onto. They easily slot into place, dead easy, no problem at all. And the kit comes with two different lengths of bolts. Obviously, this allows you to fit to different types of brackets as well. Now, I offered up and thought initially I was going to need the long bolts, but it turned out I only needed the short ones. So I swapped them over as I was fitting. It's a really simple thing to do. It's not too tricky at all. 10 millimeter little uh, nylock nuts lock the actual plate onto the bracket. And then from there, you can see it's a real easy job to actually just clip the top box on. Now, the bracket itself from Shad for the AK comes in at £89, and the top box that they've supplied us comes in at £195. There are lots and lots of add-ons and lots of accessories that you can get, including a lighting kit and a backrest. They may, I don't know, be sent to us in the future, and if so, I'll do a video on fitting them as well. If you want any more information about the products that we've actually fitted onto this bike today, go onto Shad's website, that's www.shad.co.uk. They're available through all main motorcycle dealers and outlets as well, but to go direct to the website, that's www.shad.co.uk.